This is my first event with Catholic Athletes for Christ and it's really opened my eyes to see how many kids are really a part of it and how many people like staff and grown-ups and adults that are a part of it and share their stories. And what we want to inspire in one another is a sense of leadership through sports on and off the field or on and off the perspective of where you play. It's important for us to realize that those same things that make us incredible athletes also make us incredible people. The biggest thing that uh, CIC does at RBC is that we're in charge of running food drives. Um, and I love seeing that that's something that we really take um, our, our team mentality and sort of our physical strengths as athletes into doing that kind of work, that kind of service. I've been involved in um, CAC throughout pretty much my since I was a freshman, um, but this year I've been really active in it and we pray before games, we pray after games, um, we go to church as a team. It's really nice because on my team we always take time to pray, to share what's going on in our lives, who we need to pray for. Before every game we always pray just like just to make sure that we'll do the best we can and God will be watching over. One of my favorite things about Catholic Athletes for Christ is just bringing all the athletes and stuff together and you know, talking about how we hit adversity and how faith and stuff helps us get through the adversity. It's just awesome to to share our experiences uh, on the athletic field uh, while also, you know, using faith to guide us. I started last year, and because of COVID, we weren't be able, we weren't able to come here. But I'm really glad we got to come here this year. During this hard time in the pandemic, um, we've really come together. And un unfortunately, we can't go to the soup kitchens or go to um, the veterans' home where we used to. But we we will hopefully soon. He looks to us, the Lord Jesus. He looks to us to keep our word to allow our promises to him, the things, the promises that we've already made and we spoke about, to allow them to shape what we do, to shape how we think, to shape how we live. And that's the beauty of Catholics, Catholic Athletes for Christ. It keeps that goal of fulfilling our word always before our minds,